kill you, and you're gonna uh, you're gonna stop the slaughter dagger. And Shaker's still gonna get uh, smashed by uh, yeah, Queen of Pain. Oh, yeah. No, and Dark Shield goes mid <laughs> and stacks for himself. And can't you just put Dark safely anyway now? Like against Shaker as well too, right? Could but the Darks are mid against him. SF. It's like quite disastrous, so I think. Maybe. Regardless, you could do you could do that I the other way around. I do want the Bristleback top to stop the slaughter. Oh, it's, gonna, it's gonna be Queen safe. But oh, conceptually, no conceptually, it should be Queen safe then. Yeah, uh, I like the Bristleback safe thing. I like, I like, yeah, I'd be too because I think with Bristleback I can actually dive the Earth Shaker and even if TP and then couple of them. Whereas yeah. Queen, if, I don't think Queen can apply as much pressure as, as uh, that. I, I actually think Secret can do whatever. I don't think any lane, I think Quap mid or Bristleback mid, I don't think it matters too much. It matters a lot, but uh, they can get away with everything. That's what I mean, yeah. yeah. They can definitely get away with anything they want here. They're gonna get the bounty room for the Wisp. Uh, I do I do see a good point of like having this Bristleback Wisp safe lane, but is, this is a Queen of Pain safe lane. I actually... I actually might like the Queen of Pain save him more. I think SF is going to be very easy to die for them. Uh, they blocked the entrance. I, Thank you. I, I see the point of that. Oh, that's a casual eye in shell. Um, the entrance, I definitely see a good point in that, but when I would be playing this matchup, I would usually be stacking to Woods early game, and then after four or five minutes, I start stacking it. It seems like LGD is like terrified of things. Like they're going to this game, they're already scared. In yeah. That sense. Yeah. Uh, they're not feeling so good, I think. Did the Earthshaker end up picking up boots because he was saving money? I think that's very crucial. He is not picking up boots yet. Interesting. Maybe he just goes for the soul ring and settles for constant creepway blocks. And the, 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 the thing top is, lane is so crucial. The, the new patch and, and the, the, the Dar, the when you're radiant. You don't get any experience. It's actually so hard because the wave is actually so far deep now. Yeah, yeah. So if they are able to stabilize this lane, because they shouldn't be pulling. I don't think so. I think no, they not yet. Not yet. Make not sure the structure's level one. They could stack it. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. No, this is. This is, the, this is, I mean, this is fine. Actually, okay, this is fine because they only got two creeps. Yeah, this is fine. But they need to stabilize this lane into the point where Stardar gets a ring of health or something like that, and then mm -hmm. the lane stabilizes and it's only level one iron shell. And they didn't Wiz, want the structure falling and stacking and do crazy stuff. What, what, what's the Wisp doing? He just stacking you know, right now. Wait, what? Oh, oh no! He it. Oh, oh no! Oh my God! He actually did it. The thing is, they don't really rely on it, though, do they? Because yeah. Shaker's not there to protect the SF, and uh, oh, but they can't well, stacking him yet. Doing this is ga is so game ruining. For do the you SF. think you get Bristol back? As this, a spell, this, this the spell, the first spell. Uh, when you just get Goo? I think you get Goo. Get Goo for sure. Yeah. I mean, this would have been a kill. This would have been a kill with yeah. Goo, 100%. Might still be like, one without, but... Yeah, it's one without. I, like, look at how the Goo, how much yeah. smoother this would have been with Goo. I think if he, he has to run that, I don't know why he has to stop to turn to race. Yeah, yeah. Gave up. Gave up on life. You have, to, you have to hold on that little bit of hope you have to get out of that. There was a small chance because there was no Goo. I think he could have gotten out. I, I actually... But I think the problem right now is the Shaker is off lane. And yeah. he... His rotations to protect the SF are very hard to do. Like, he doesn't really have the option. Uh, I don't a know. Bottle. I think he has a fucking bottle. Holy shit. What's happening? happening? That could have been a game when oh, he he he's, gonna, he's gonna die mid again now. Is that. Yeah. This is not what you can have happen. Oh, against not, a wisp the ever. TP is not gonna do shit either. Oh, he's dead. He's dead too. He's dead too. Oh, Shaker's dead. Oh, no, Shaker's here. Yeah, but no, no, no. He's still, they're all dead. I think they might all be dead. Yeah. I see it happening. Uh, yeah, double, double heal. He also has a flash. Oh. He has a self. Is that boost? Oh just gonna my god. And they're gonna keep chasing. Yeah, he can tether the dazzle. Uh, he doesn't even need to. No. This is not what can have happen against Wisp. You do not leave the SF in the ditch like this. But this level 1 pull by the Wisp leaves the Wisp to get level 2 on his own and mm. Bristleback to get level 2 on his own. Mm. Even though the Bristleback didn't use his level 2 because he skilled the back, which actually did nothing, it, it still like takes away XP from the SF. Like. And now the Rubik left top. Dark is pulling. Yeah, this is Lane very is so dangerous. unstable now. The thing is, like, conceptually, I feel like when LGD looks at this game, what I'd be scared playing as SF is obviously the Wisp Bristleback lane or any, any rotation. If it's Quap Wisp or Bristol Wisp, doesn't matter. And then you put a shake on off lane and he's not able to rotate. And you have Rubik and AA. They, are not, they don't do anything to protect the, the SF at all. No. That's very <laughs> dangerous. So, yeah, she got off to a good start in early game again. Seemed to. Seem to win lanes again, just like last game. Let's see if they can uh, use it. 
as well as they did last game. Oh, this is a that again now. They're leaving. Oh, Rubik, no, he might be Rubik might be in here. Good position. A chilling touch. Still kill the SM. Is he, is he really gonna get out of here? The bomb is going up. He's getting out. He's, he is. Oh, oh, that was so close. There's that was a moment problems. though when, when when people say focus the wisp because right there, if the SF puts the razors on the wisp, I don't think this happens. I think he's alive. Yeah, potentially. Uh, I um, I'm still not sure. This does not help the the, the game that much overall because the SF did not get much from that. I he didn't get anything from yeah, that. Yeah, of course. And the 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 mid situation is still the level three SF. Level five, Bristol back. All right. He didn't even go boots. He's killing Bracer. Oh wow. Now they can't leave the starter top against the Darkseer one v one, and supports can't leave the SF mid one v one. He is out of mana too. And right. we're having the same situation as last game. The Queen of Pain oh. is versus zero heroes because the offlaner goes middle lane. Now there's going to be an early orchid. This is going to be their pick off or another item if he chooses. Like Hex is a more stable mm. pick off item, but. This Queen of Pain is gonna go ham if uh, the Secret chooses not to go on the SF from from now on and focus farming. They're still gonna be winning this game heavily. They're not giving up. They're, they're a good Fisher, but oh, no, on the wrong side. Oh. Tether's back up, double heal coming in. The DP came in from Rubik, but they're he's on the other again. side. They're all dead again. This Rubik has to start running. Rubik has to get out of this. Rubik, you're dead. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> yep, you're dead. Uh, you can't level, play against Wisp 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 like that. You can't just expect him. To be able to TP in uh, and, uh, and with these heroes, Rubik is not gonna help an SF that has 12 hit points. It, it just doesn't work like that. So the Bristol bag chose to go for really small items, tanked up a lot, uh, had room to go trust. Now they actually killed the Darks here. Wow, that's a small glimmer of hope for LTV. They need. They got Slaughter and they need A ulti and they have to make magic happen with that, I think. I'm gonna kill Manus too much, honestly. He's still out of region. I mean, and, uh, yeah. the, uh, whatever happens for LTD, like, if, if they're not killing Wisp and Bristleback for nothing, uh. it almost doesn't matter at this point. The, and the SF has to start getting these kills. Like, this SF, level 4, I think, at this point. This Bristleback getting us, get, keep getting small items, getting a cloak now against all this magic damage that LTD have. They do not have the levels for the Miner's armor yet. That's a level 4 SF. I mean, I don't want to talk about... I mean, I kind of want to talk about a drop, actually, because it's, it's kind of weird how they didn't pick Wisp. It, I mean, it's, didn't that's, pick so, SF. that's so shocking. Hmm. What, it, what it, we went for it. Because they banned the Wisp, because they're scared of the Wisp. And all these shiny teams banned the Wisp. Then when the Wisp is actually available, and they, they can actually play the hero, they don't play it themselves. Yeah. Now they're setting up again for the SF mid. Balls are already out. They're gonna actually scout him out with the balls. Oh, they are so close. They find him though. He's completely alone again. Are there gonna be any TPs? They've given I think up. They gave up. They gave up. They gave up on the TP. Level seven. If there's a stack and a jungle now, they're gonna farm it too. There's not. There's no stacks. You think, you think they're gonna rotate yeah. everybody? Yeah. There we go. Trains running. If they go on the Dox in now, queen, goodbye. Queen's up, queen's up there. Level six. He's gonna get the grave off. Puppy TPing in queen. Triple Sonic wave. Oh my God. Are they gonna get the slaughter? This is the big one. They get the Rubik. Just a walk over. They're all dead. They could call it right here if they wish. Like I don't not. I do not see how. What did he do here? What did he? Uh, you have, like I say, no lanes to go. Relocate is gonna come out soon. There's no lane you want to be on. There's nothing that really protects you but a Fisher, and he's under leveled. They can't even turn even with the Fisher. They can try to run out, but Bristol's just gonna end up catching up anyway. And here we go. It's us. there we go. Fisher coming in. Nice Fisher though. This can't probably, turn. But they yeah. can't turn. They, they two TPs invested. They. Forced a, a load of protection. Look at this cloak doing again. work. But they have no damage whatsoever for him. Yeah. I mean, got top tower. Super good timely rotations from Secret. Um, nice item pickups. Nice decision making. And overall, like they again put way too much pressure all over the map. With lanes that fit, like have match of favors, Darkseer versus Slaughter, Clockwork versus Lycan, making the supports move. Look at Wisp net worth. Just look at it. Oh my God! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> it's, uh, often this is what can happen with the Wisp. Like we have way too good of a game. You just pick up the urn. You pick up the mana boots. Darkseer, Dazzle, Queen. Nobody's gonna be out of mana this game. Mm -hmm. And yeah, Darkseer got all the levels he wished he wished for. Bristleback is going all tanky items, no reason to buy in a region. I wonder what he's buying. Uh, he might go Glimmer Cave. I think he's gonna settle with a Glimmer Cave. He might? He has mana for it. He's got a Wisdom in his team. 
and uh, there's a lot of magic, magic damage on the on the dive side. I, I think a Sanj into the Sanj and Yasha is. I honestly, he might good. just go pipe because they have the, the possibility to break base here. He might go pipe. Yeah, he might go pipe. Um, was that a bit booster on chicken for somebody? That's that is our thesis. thesis. Yeah, so I guess it's just a Vanguard. Ah, so it's it's weird how he builds the zero though, because he's. I I prefer the Glimmer King over Vanguard actually. Nah, because of the item slots. He's it's, got a. St it's he's the got item a slots, but a cloak. It's got more, a more about the hero match. Uh, look at the enemy team. Mm. He's not gonna be dying to physical damage like, for a while. I feel like he can get whatever fuck he wants. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm, more, I'm, I'm looking <laughs> at like OGE. I'm trying to figure out how they can actually come back into this game because I feel like Secret has. Secret can do anything. They they don't even need to play perfect here. Mm. They can do whatever, and, yeah. and and whatever play they'll make, it'll work. So it just, but what's OG gonna do here? It's pretty much. Actually, I mean, if I was Secret, I would uh, do what they're doing right now. Settle down, get the bank, get the orchid on the Queen of Pain. Wait for relocate. I mean, look at the SF. Where's the SF at? Like, the slaughter. I mean, uh, Cause, cause can, OG can find my smoke and go on the Queen, and that won't do anything because those get relocated. Around. Oh boy, the slaughter is right next to the SF, pretty much hugging a tower. Uh, they're all in vi all in vision. Secret knows what they're doing. Secret are just finishing up their items right now. Farming the ancient, farming the Queen of Pain. Uh, Dazzle stacking, Darkseer's farming away. Uh, I feel like Clou Cloud Nine would, would come into play here, and we would do some random shit. Uh, I would I would go for Rosha. You'd be in Rosha uh, pit right I, now. I don't know what I would sure. do. I I would do some shit. You'd be in Rosha pit right uh, now. I would give up instantly in this situation. Nah, you you have to pull out some magic to to bring this game back. Maybe LG is the team to do it. You don't know. But uh, it looks pretty grim. You they have, to, have, you have to, to admit. They have to hit their spells in such ways to turn a fight. They have to hit raises. But they have to fight. They can't gank, right? Like, they, they can only to gank the Wisp Bristleback. Because any yeah. and even then, they can always no. rotate with the they, Queen. Yeah, TP. that's not gonna happen. Actually, they actually can't do anything. The, so right. Secret, Secret are always admit. so good at using his advantage. Oh, look if you look at the wards and stuff, they always give the enemy as little as possible, as little farm as possible from the advantage they have in the early game, they just take away everything. The jungle is taken, they're gonna run to the engines now probably and ward up there, the usual Russian ward and whatever. That's spotted. Straight up smoke, well, they're in a a ward. Maybe. I don't think it matters so much though. I think I'm gonna place the, the favorite ward. Puppy's gonna run into the pit, place the ward maybe. Nah, it's not. He doesn't have one. doesn't have one. That's, uh, oh, that's a two-man Fisher, but this uh, ES is just left to die. This, I, I have way better games than this offlane shaker on my four support shaker. Oh, I mean, RTZ is doing his classic oh, wow. <laughs> no, I don't think he can throw this game. It, 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 I actually it, it, don't it, think it, it he can throw. doesn't matter, but like, you, you can tell by the way he plays and how his team plays. It's like his team is like, there's no point in doing these plays, you know? And RTZ is like, fuck it. I think he's just enjoying life right now. Being a Bristleback, if I was playing as Bristleback, I'd be happy yeah. for sure. I'd just run at them. And, uh, you would stress your team for sure. Uh, and uh, no, I, I, I just, no, you, you actually can't die. There's no way you will You can't die. There's no way. You, it might not be the best move, but you can have some fun, right? And you just, just run at them. That's what you do. Yeah, like I said, if I'm LGD, I would probably try and bait with my Ancient Apparition. And then I would try to get like a four-man Fisher into four-man races, into four-man Rubik Nuke. Uh, just like you have these two top teams playing, and Secret's actually breaking records while doing so. Yeah. So. No, Secret put the pressure in the right places. A ult is up, so this should be. A, yeah, they can't do this. Yeah, they shouldn't do. They're it. backing off. They uh, they know LG they could be moving. Chilling touch was used. You know that you can remove it now, right? Chilling touch. I click on it right yeah, on the little icon. Right click yeah. on it. Um, this is a nice future. I think they should do the same to other spells such as. Call recall. We can yeah, move it. Yeah, that's, that's that's good. Um, Poppy picked up a uh, medallion on his dazzle. Uh, S4 must be closer to the orchid than that. Oh, that crimson is. Yeah, there we go. He almost has it. Very good. He's uh, only a recipe away. Crimson finished. Oh, Artis is running oh, in here. The wisp is far away, but the dash yeah. is in range. This is gonna turn up. Yeah, this is not gonna happen. The weave didn't hit him. Oh my god, a triple sonic wave again from S4. The relocate coming in. He brings in the dark seer. Is there a vacuum? Vacuum hits. Oh my god. Secret are uh, running them they, over. They can't fight at all. They go yes. one dark seer return. Four kills right in. Wow. That's this is exactly what you don't want when you're smoking. Imagine you're smoking and and you see this burst back, and he might be alone, but you can't do anything against it. You just <laughs> this guy he turns you back to you, and uh, you kind of just want to run away. Yeah, I mean this. So uh, sometimes 
this Dazzle was all they needed to be in position. The Wisp yeah. could have been there, but Dazzle being there means there's no way this this will ever, ever work. Um, yeah, do you see Aegis for Bristolback? I have no idea what you do here as LGD. Well, I don't think you can do it. Uh, now, just hitting spells doesn't work anymore. Uh, yeah. <laughs> when you when, when you hit all your spells and all of them and that doesn't work, what do you <laughs> what do you what do you do? <laughs> I mean, what do you do? Bristol will still kill all five of them. It's depressing. Uh, Look at LGD's lineup right now, and it, it's like it's going pipe. I think yeah, yeah pipe. Yeah, pipe. El pipe. And there's gonna be a mech on the darks here. If it's not already finished, it's already finished. Another fifteen hundred gold. Could be picking up a Blink Dagger or even going for the Greaves, because why not? Well, both teams, it seems like LGD has to... Like, That's a haste use. Are they actually just going to run down Yesa with a Dark Seer? <laughs> he is completely alone. They don't care. The vacuum was used too early, though. He's still dead off. No. Okay, so. the, 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 the SF illusion was hitting uh, neutral creeps. Was, uh, was deeping up, so also, know, if the Val dark. wall was there earlier, the one point in the, the minus armor, you know... I don't know, man. Definitely a game breaker. What's Secret can't win anymore. But, like the way LG is drafting right now, it's, it's, even though it's a different draft version from DC, it seems like it's kind of the same. They always have these lineups that like have to, like you have to kind of survive the early game. Yeah. And then, even though you survive, you don't exactly win the late game either. Yeah. Like with their more supports and stuff. Like that. Uh, it's you don't exactly have to win it if Secret have more farm, but I'd say if LGD are even on farm. Yeah, that's, what, that's, what, that's what I mean, right? Like, that's what I mean. Like, they always try to get these lineups that are kind of greedy in a sense. Yeah. They try to survive, and then once they survive, they have a lineup that's supposedly better in the mid to late game, yeah. but it's not really true. Yeah. And they're always playing very reactionary. I think this game, LGD, can we just can't do the, can't do anything to stop Secret from smashing something? But in the last game, I feel like it was very easily possible. Can we just look at the rune spawns? Like, see which rune spawn where. The rest of the game. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, we can we can go for a gamble. Uh, actually, uh, I'm, I'm I'm saying bottom rune is a region. I'm saying top rune is a DD. No, you're stupid. I mean, I'm right. No, yeah, you're definitely. There's right. a blink now on Slaughter, but they just can't be invade. Secret are farming the whole map. Se five seconds for the rune spawn. Right. Yeah, yeah, yo. Excitement, excitement right here. Oh, Crow, Crow wants region, the region right there. Crow wants the region, Bob. Oh, 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 oh my God. Oh, Jake knew it was an illusion. You just didn't say it because he's humble. Humble. Humble Mao. <laughs> well, I don't have much to say, honestly. This game is. This game <laughs> if you have nothing yeah. to say, you can play the the, the rune game with possible. us. I actually have nothing to say. Both games, both games. I was like, I try to figure out what's come back. Oh, is that? No, did you smoke? Right, yeah. I think the last game was interesting because no, you don't. could see the mistakes. What happened? Oh, oh Ford just blinked in. He might get picked off here. Grave hits. Right, oh, they just run away he's now. He's dead right? already. He's but dead. the Sonic Wave hits on three heroes yet again. That's a triple, triple Sonic Wave. That was a throw. That was a slight throw. Oh, the mech comes off the double bl uh, crush. Shadow Fiend ultimate hits, but doesn't do anything. Run into the wall. The Minus armor right there. Oh my god. That's a Fisher stolen by the Rubik. I think Secret have way too much space to do whatever they want. Like. I mean, there's no Rubik. That was, what am I talking about? The Rubik on their team. <laughs> I think they wait for AA ult, you know? And uh, Slaughter jumps in. Yeah, again. wait for the AA ult, Slaughter jumps in. Maybe Rubik got to steal something nice. Oh, look, look at this person. We have goals on him. Just look at him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm actually not sure. RTC is running in. He still has Yegis with the pipe and the Crimson Guard. He's just walking around. Now. Like, there's actually no way he's taking this seriously. <laughs> Crush he's actually in a very down. weird position. S4 oh, he's 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 gonna gonna get saved, he's gonna get bought back. Uh, and he's running here. And every look at every look at He has a mana though. Oh, they can't even. Oh, there's a double, re uh, double heal from the Tazzle. The Sun Prox, that's a mech use Darks here. He is not going down. He is just tanking all of them. You know you can die Fountain with Crimson God ready? Maybe we see this happening this game. He could. How's it work? Huh? How's it work? I mean, uh, Maybe you can dive it. It blocks the tower, the hits, right? It's, yeah, if you it's fast hits but low damage. So oh. if you weave yourself and like you pop Crimson Guard. Was that a buyback from uh, LGD? Uh, Rubik? Well, it has to be for us. Yeah, the Rubik bought back. Uh, yes, can we just look back. back at the net worth chart? Can we just enjoy this moment for a second? Oh, oh SF caught up with the dazzle. SF caught up with the dazzle. Finish the mech. 
Oh, they actually might catch Sire. They have a ward on the hill. Oh, nice blink. The crush was not fast enough. They might still catch him. They might still be down. Put the wall down, just cause. Yeah, they got him. Oh, vacuum. Oh. Nice vacuum. The dagger will be ready now. All right, Sai on fire here. Sai's Dark is pretty amazing. Uh, yeah, Red Bull was really, really impressive as well. Yeah, it's really no, that's an interesting from LG, like the way they think about the game. Like, they actually feel like they can win this team, I think, in a sense. Like, they, they expect plays like that to happen. I mean, like, 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 like our TZ to like, uh, yeah. pass the terror forward, like, that's what they're banking on right mm -hmm. now. I like, mean, it's like kind of like a pub mentality where you feel like the enemy can always fuck up like, to, a, to a level where you can mm -hmm. still win the game under any situation. Yeah. I mean, and in both games, you can kind of see it kind of working. Yeah. Even though it was both impossible, like, I, I thought it was both impossible, like the, the way they were playing. It's like, it's actually, you can see some sort of hope. The they're hoping for clowny Western players to, to throw. Yeah, exactly. Glimmer K picked up by the Wisp. I mean, th I think this is one of the most game stealing items. When you have, like, yeah. we see this Bristol back, he tanks up. Crimson Guard pipe. Mech on the... Somebody gets a solo crest too. Uh, yeah, Valor, uh, whatever. He, uh, he can die found with a solo crest for sure. Yeah. He can die found. But this Glimmer Cape item is one of the best value items if you time it right. And uh, the ALT is hitting, the races are hitting. This mm. Glimmer Cape, you do not care. And he also has a pipe, so... Yeah. I... Uh... LGD can hope for RTC to uh, make some moves here. Weave hits on two. There's going to be Sonic Wave hitting two here. Yep. Rubik already down to half HP. Stick brings him up a little bit. Courier goes down. Zero cargo worth though, so it's fine. Well, well. That's the moment where you just have to stay in base. Yeah, you're, you're actually not allowed to move, move out of base. What item do you pick up together with these two items in the Bristol bag? I generally never go these two items. I, I don't think he does. I don't think any Bristol does. But in a game like this, uh -huh. when you're just you know doing this, what do you buy right life. now? I would buy anything that allows me to die fountain, honestly. Yeah, I think evasion, right? Yeah. I mean, no. I want somebody to buy solo crest for me. Uh, and maybe yeah. just. Oh, the Fisher blocks on TZN, but he has his back turned, so he has he has some uh, not so good armor on him right now. The... Yeah. Orchid use on Slaughter. Raxes are slowly going down. LGD yeah. trying to hold high ground like they did last game. I think they should tether the Queen of Pain next and give him full mana. Crimson Guard was used, so they are just going all in now for the Raxes. Crush hits. This, uh, this Bristol is going low right now. They need to get the overcharge up on him. Oh, there we have it. Yeah. Five man vacuum wall. Sigh. Doing work for Secret here. Oh my god. Four, four man crush though. Artisi still staying alive. He's been below half HP for a while now. That's a buyback from Shaker. Five men weave by Puppy. If they go right now, I don't think LGD can ever, ever kill him before this weave runs out. Another nice Fisher blocking in heroes, blocking other heroes out. TP coming in from Rubik from behind. Uh, yeah, it got cancelled. We should, we should make a hype cast out of this. Like, uh, wow. Like it is if it's the most close game that you ever had. <laughs> and then oh my god, Bristol going down. Oh, another four man vacuum my side. Are you kidding me, man? The wall was stolen though, right? That's a stone wall. I'm not so sure. This actually, uh, Bristol is actually dead, I believe. No. Nope. The ALT runs out. Pipe is also used. A goes down. There it is. That's a good game. Called by Shawi. There it is. Wow. I mean, I must say, there was. Wow. Easier for Secret than I thought it would be. I, I mean, didn't expect it to be this. Actually, yeah. who are we kidding? Every every game this tournament is going to be 2-0. Yeah, so probably. whoever wins the first game wins the second. <laughs> <laughs>